Now, some people actually enjoy paying taxes. In Mexico, well, a government program there allows artists to donate works of art to pay off their tax debts. Frank Contreras has this. Mexican painter Antonio Ortiz, also known as Griton, has had a fulfilling career. His work has been shown in Canada, Japan, Italy, Spain, the United States, and soon in Switzerland. As his sales rise, so do the amount of taxes he owes the Mexican government. But under a government program, the only one of its kind, Ortiz and other artists pay their taxes by in-kind donations of their own original works of art. I don't need an accountant. I don't need to worry about my monthly tax declarations like other Mexicans. I just take one day a year and decide which piece to donate. This is one of his pieces now showing at a museum in Mexico City. The exposition includes 114 works by artists participating in this program. There are just a few of the more than 6,400 pieces of art donated under the Pay in Kind program. The collection includes sculptures and paintings from Mexicans and foreigners living in this country who have paid their taxes by donating these works of art. The program began in 1975, and since then, the in-kind donations have produced an impressive art collection that is Mexico's fourth largest. It includes works by Diego Rivera and Frida Kahlo. The government official who directs the Pay in Kind program says the idea came in 1957 from Mexican muralist David Alfaro Siqueiros, who approached the Secretary of Finance with a proposal to keep a fellow artist out of jail for tax evasion. Maestro Siqueiros sat down with the government director of tax income and argued that artists often don't concern themselves with matters of accounting, and they should be allowed to pay with what they know how to do, works of art. Each year, a committee of art experts decides which pieces can be donated in place of paying taxes. The Mexican government raffles off the paintings and sculptures to museums across the country. Officials and artists alike say the program is successful because it helps raise awareness of the vast richness of this country's cultural life. Frank Contreras, CCTV, Mexico City.